I don't even want to do the intro looking like this. Hey guys, it's Ava, and welcome back to my channel. I look like this right now. I looked like this through the entire first period, and then my teacher was like, Hey, let's show our faces. And I was like, No, here's my ceiling. Well, today, as you saw by the title, is a little get ready with me. I figured I'd film one. So, I'm going to pick my outfit first. I planned my outfits, like, for the week, like, Monday through Friday in advance. So, this is the one I planned for today. It's this little sweater vest moment. And this thing underneath it. Also, these jeans. Listen to that sound. Ow. I'm going to put this outfit on, and then I will get back to you. This collar looks like this because I have to put necklaces on and I'm not going to keep flapping it up and down. I'm going to wear these Nike socks. I just forget how to wear belts. For the longest time, like, you know how a belt, like, goes like that and then also goes through this thing? I kept forgetting to put it through that thing and it just looked like that. And I looked stupid. But yeah, this is me putting on a belt. Are you happy that my content is coming this? Oh, Lord. Um, <laughs> so I'm hugging in my straightener right now. Um, you can't see me because I'm on the floor. This is what the hair looks like in the morning. Wait, my hair could have looked cute wavy today. Oh well, too late. I don't really know what else to say, except for- I'm brushing my hair. My head is so like oddly shaped. Hair is brushed out. Feel like my camera is way too low. No, that's not better. Okay, oh Lord, look at my part. Why does it look like that? We're gonna fix it. We have this little brush. That's kind of better, I guess. That's as good as the part is gonna get. I was gonna wear eyeliner with this, but then I remembered the last time I tried to do eyeliner was horrifying. My straightener is ready. Okay, straightening your hair is such a process. I want to do something with my hair, but I can't cut it because I have a dance competition. So what should I do? Like, what color should I make it? It can't be like a crazy color because again, dance competition. I don't know. I just want to do something different. I'm sick of like these highlights. I don't really want them anymore. Like, I'm just sick of looking at myself with the same hair. Oh my god, last time I dyed my hair, like, darker, I looked like Casper the Ghost. But we'll probably do it again. But comment below and tell me what you think I should do with my hair. My face is so hot. I need to order new skincare products and I just got like a new face wash because my skin right now I don't know if you could see like this is without makeup like, can't even see but it's like very much pimples I'm gonna like try to order new skincare stuff I feel like I need some of it you see if straightening my hair was easy I could look good all the time also I wish straightening your hair and like actually doing your hair didn't take so long also heat damage I wish that wasn't a thing my hair is probably heat damage but we're not gonna talk about it I don't want highlights anymore I want darker hair I wanna you know we're gonna go darker brown eventually I always say that but then I like never do my hair I'll come up with an idea and then I won't do it like red hair I wanted red hair since I was probably like five years old. Never dyed my hair fully red. I did in sixth grade with like red strips or something like that. I don't even know what it's called. If I can find a picture, I'll insert it. Um, yeah, that was not a good look for me. I kind of looked weird. I just don't think I'm supposed to have red hair. That's why I don't have red hair right now. But maybe eventually I'll do like this type of red, but like I don't think I can get this type of red because... I was born with brown hair. Can I just be done now? Can we just call this done? I don't know if I straightened it the whole way, so now I'm gonna do a little twirl. No! God, please, no! No! Okay, so after I straighten my hair, I put this stuff in it. It, like, makes it less frizzy. It doesn't really do much, but it does a little something. So I'm gonna be wearing this one and this one. They're both from Shein. Literally this whole outfit. This shirt, this... These jeans and this belt are all from Shein. It takes me forever to put on these necklaces because I never know how loose to make it, how tight to make it. It's just like not very fun to put them on. This one I usually leave like inside of the collar. See? Little 
jewelry moment. Now I'm pretty sure it's time to move on to makeup. So I'm gonna put my hair in a scrunchie and I know I just like straightened it but I'm not, oh what is that? Broken hair. I'm not gonna like wrap the scrunchie around. I'm just gonna like leave it loose so it doesn't ruin my hair. Oh look at my phone case. And also I want to show you my iOS 14. We have this little screen and then you swipe and then it's this and then this area. Look at that little teddy bear. And then this. Okay, so usually what I do is I start with concealer. And I ran out of my other one, so now I'm using it's this one. I'm sorry, I don't know if that's in focus. I usually take this and put it on my pimples. And then I pack it into my skin with a dry beauty blender. I don't really know if this actually works because you can still see my pimples through the freaking thing. I'm gonna try to like completely cover them today. It definitely helps, like it makes it a little bit better. I guess you just have to put more and more on, but at the same time, I have no patience. Like that's the after of my nose. There's still freaking marks on it. That's a big glob. <laughs> Next, we're going to move on to lashes, and I think that's like a weird place to jump to, but it's fine because I don't really do anything. Like, I pretty much wear just natural makeup. This one is the one I use like every day when I'm out of it. What I do is like curl my eyelashes, and then it still looks like I have no lashes, but that's fine, I guess. So I'm going to use this mascara. I get, no, there's not really a difference. Like, maybe I just need new mascara. Then I take, like, this thing, and it's also, like, a brow pencil, but I never use the pencil side. I don't pencil in my brows. I just, like, brush them up and try to get them to look normal. I just realized you're watching, like, literally the side profile of my freaking face through this whole video. I am so sorry. Um, at least you can kind of see me now. <laughs> this eyebrow is always the problem. I don't know. I just don't like doing stuff on this side of my face, so maybe that's the problem. I don't know. It just looks like it goes down too early. I hate this eyebrow so freaking much. Oh my god. Okay, well, guess who's leaving her eyebrow like that? It looks like I have an eyebrow slip, but I swear I never even, like, try to slit my eyebrow because I think I will look bad with an eyebrow slit. There's just random holes that pop up in my eyebrow all the time for literally no reason. I put on too much. This is how I look today. I went from rat to slightly better looking rat, so... Yay me! But anyways, thank you so much for watching this video. If you liked it, please make sure you hit like and subscribe. I'm trying to hit 700 subscribers. And also make sure you follow me on everything else. I just hit 60k on TikTok, which is literally unbelievable to me. So thank you so much. Also, I have a surprise coming at 100k on TikTok. So make sure you go follow my TikTok. It's at Ava Mercedes. And also, I just did a follow spree on TikTok because I hit 60k. So when I hit 70k, I'll be doing one of those again. Alright, I love you guys. Bye!